So I think I've basically decided that next semester I am not going to continue doing Thursday, the day that I dread of every week because, you know, because I don't want to be at school until 6 o'clock at night. It'll probably end up being 6.30. Yeah? Do we need a story time? Okay, so, little Missy, my little Missy, I have to be at school at around 9.30. Yeah? 9.30 in the morning. Uh -huh. Yep. And then I have class from 10 until 10.50. And then I don't have another class until 12.40. That goes till 1.30. Yeah? Mm-hmm. You following? And then I don't have another class until 4 o'clock. And that class lies till 6 o'clock, which ends up being like 6.30 o'clock. And that's no good. So I'm going to be at school for almost nine hours. And I only have three classes. Is that funny? Do we find this funny? I know. Mama's got to get her crap together. So I think I've basically decided that next semester I am not going to continue doing ROTC classes. Um, <laughs> Which means Mama's going to be here more often. She's going to be here in the mornings every day when you wake up. Yes? Yes. Um, because the process that it's going to take to be able to contract would be way too complicated. I don't want to put um, that much responsibility on my mom because ultimately my mom would end up having either custody or legal guardianship, or something in that nature of Annabelle, and I just, I'm her mom. <laughs> I want to be her mom. I want to raise her and be with her as much as I possibly can, and even though I was planning on going into the National Guard beforehand, it's a lot harder to do something like that when you already have a child. I was extremely passionate about being in the military, but um, just the process that it takes in my situation is a little too much, and I want to be here for my daughter, and I don't want her to feel like I'm leaving her, and yeah. So, I'm going to finish off this semester with the ROTC classes that I have. They are adding credits to my transcript, so, I mean, it's not a complete loss, but there are other classes I could be taking during this time. Instead, she does not like when I'm talking and I'm not talking to her. <laughs> so, that's where we are at, and she doesn't seem to be too happy about it. Why are you not happy about this? This is for you. Everything I do. Everything I do is for you. Is that not good enough? Is that not good enough for you? Not good enough for you? Oh, shit. Hi. You yeah, got Cheerios? Yeah? I does not mean. Are those nummy Cheerios? Yummy nummies? Nummies! <sighs> Hello guys, it has been way too many hours, and by way too many hours I mean like nine. And that's a lot of hours. I got home, 
I don't know, like half an hour ago, an hour ago, and now I'm getting Annabelle ready for bed. So basically, Annabelle woke up at 6.45 today. I got to hang out with her for a couple hours, and I left, and I am back just in time to put her to bed. still summer um i put her in just onesies i put her in sleepers that are like thin cotton ones i put her in literally like every other kind of pajamas there is oh, one sec better and she always sleeps the best in these kind of pajamas so i just stick with it i don't worry about it I mean, I keep an eye on her at night. I make sure that her room doesn't get too warm. My monitor actually does beep um, when it gets to a certain temperature. I think it's set at 82 right now. So if it gets to 82 or above, it'll start beeping. So that's kind of how I regulate that. But she sleeps well. So I'm not going to question it. I'm going to do what works best for her. And what works best for her typically works best for me. Because... Yeah. What are you doing, you crazy baby? You gotta finish your bottle. I know, you just finished lunch. Or dinner. What time is it? Is that funny? Vlogging? Okay, you vlog. You hold it. Here you go. Hold it. took a shower, put Annabelle down to sleep, well, put Annabelle down to sleep, then took a shower, and now I am finishing up some homework that is due tomorrow, because it's due at like 9 o'clock in the morning, I don't get done with PT until 7.30, and so if I don't do it now, I probably just won't do it. Finally done with that stupid homework took a lot longer than I expected and now people from my business law class are all texting in the group chat at literally nine o'clock and I'm sure it'll go on for who knows how long and it's just so annoying because the group chat is for a group project which they're not telling anyone anything about 
what they use to group chat for things like, hey, do we have a quiz tomorrow? Hey, look on the fucking syllabus because all the f due dates are on there and all the dates for all the tests and quizzes are on there. So if there's a quiz, it's not that hard to find out. So you don't have to text in the group chat. And no, she didn't cancel class tomorrow. If she canceled class tomorrow, you'd know she'd send you an email. People in college are so dumb. And it's not everybody, but like, freshmen. Freshmen are dumb. I know I'm a freshman, but freshmen are dumb. Anyway, I'm going to bed. I have to wake up at 4.30 tomorrow. So early. But I should just get used to it, I guess. And, yeah, hopefully I can sleep. But I'm sad because nobody that I want to text me back is texting me back right now. And I'm just, I'm just lonely, you know? Yeah. Good night, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope you're having a good day or a good night, wherever you are, whenever you're watching this. I'm so sorry for the boringness and the rants in this vlog. Good night. <laughs>